the X System Nail Polish Kit from Sephora. Um, now, I've always been one of those nail biters. Yeah. And I finally broke myself of the nail biting habit. Finally, after years, 20 some odd years of chewing my nails, and so I actually have kind of nails. And I thought um, I would try one of those fancy nail kits to see if I could get nail polish to stay better. Because I know from previous experience it chips and whatever. It gets those little get the lines if you don't wait long enough. And it gets just, it's too much of an effort usually. I originally wanted to get one of those little gel kits. And then I went to Sephora and saw they were $150. And I said, hmm, I think I'll try the $30 kit first. This is not a gel kit. So what it comes with, it comes with a cleanser, a primer, you get to pick one shade of nail polish, and I pick this kind of really pretty light purpley, lavenderish color, and then it comes with a top coat. So let me start with the things that I liked about this kit. Um, I like the fact that you basically got one of the nail things for free because they're a little over $10 a piece, so $30 for four things, that's one for free. So that was nice. Um, it dried really, really fast. Um, I've never used any non-drugstore uh, nail polish before, and so I could definitely tell these are higher quality. They dried really fast, and so that was nice, so I didn't have to wait forever. Um, like in high school, I would like do a coat, wait an hour, do the next coat, wait an hour, do the other coat, and I'm like, I don't have that many hours to do my nails, especially if it's not going to stick. So. It looked really nice. It was very easy. Went on smooth. And oh my goodness, it lasted. It lasted one day. It lasted two days. It was gorgeous. On the third day, it started to chip, but I wasn't going to freak out yet because I thought, mm, two days, that's still pretty good. And then later in that third day, it started to peel off my nails. And not just like little chips, like sheets would just peel. The whole sheet of nail would just peel off. And I could tell that it was pulling off part of the surface of my nail too. So, that really bummed me out because up until that point, I was really excited about this brand. And unfortunately, this is going to have to go back to Sephora because I think that's unacceptable for it to last two days and then completely peel off. Especially if you're going to be ruining my nails. So, that was my thoughts. I may have to just suck it up and save up $150 to get one of those little gel kits. But I thought I would let you guys know here. Um, the other thing that I did to test this out, I tested it out. I used the cleanser, then I used my own nail polish, and then I put the top coat on from this kit to see, well, maybe it's the base coat that sticks too much to the nail polish and not enough to my nails, and it still was doing the peeling thing. So I know if I have a okay, uh, my own nail polish that it doesn't do that by itself. So that was pretty upsetting. Alright, that's all I have. If you have any tips for nail polish brands or types of things to get something that will last and is not going to do the peeling thing, let me know because I would love to be able to paint my nails now that I have nails.